All right, time to go. No one has been made aware of his feelings, but growing stronger through his battles. While he's training, Goku informs him of the, term the Tournament of Power. Hearing that the losing universe will be annihilated, Gohan decides to participate in the tournament as a defender of Universe 7. To prepare for the Tournament of Power, Gohan trains ferociously with Piccolo and regains his fighting instincts. He takes Piccolo's warnings to heart and begins a special program that enables him to fight more aggressively. The Tournament of Power finally begins. Gohan and his friends watch each other's backs and whittle down their enemies, but as the battle royale heats up, they shift in the fight individually. They shift to fighting individually. Get out of my way. Powerful foes arrive, one after another. Results of Gohan training show, and he has conquered his merciful nature. He fights without letting up, surviving almost until the very end. While the battle rages on, Frieza watches Gohan from the sidelines. Once Gohan battle is finished and his exhaustion is at its peak, Frost appears. Although Frieza is supposed to be an ally, he now joins forces with Frost and he takes the fight to Gohan. Damn. Would you mind hiding down? Master, go! I suppose the cat is out of the bag now. <laughs> Would you mind hiding down? Would you mind hiding down? Over here! Shoot! Take it! Nice! Would you mind piping down? My turn now! Would you mind piping down? This will finish you off. Come on, come Rizzi knocks off his supposed ally Frost out of the arena, but then from behind him... <coughs> Look, he got back up! Gohan, are you gonna be okay? Does this mean what I think it does? Those two are only pretending to brawl. When I took that first attack, I knew right away you were holding back. So then I chose to play along with whatever you had planned. Well, if you had been too dense to figure it out, then I would have had no choice but to kill you. At least we know for certain that Frieza is truly on our side. I don't think I'd go that far. Yeah, if Gohan hadn't caught on to what he was up to, Frieza would have betrayed us in a heartbeat, that's for sure. What? My dear Gohan, that was fun. We should try to continue working together as we move toward victory. Shall we? No, 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 think about it. They, they, they could have put the other Namekians in here. They probably do it as DLC. Unable to completely trust Frieza, Gohan continues to give his full strength. He joins forces with Piccolo and they progress through the tournament. The other Universe 7, war seven Warriors are triumphing over their opponents. As the Universes lose one by one, the racing Piccolo leaves the fray. 
The tournament is nearing its end and battles have no room for an easy win. But Gohan, Goku, and others join forces to defeat the most powerful enemy. Before long, only Universe 7 and 11 remain. Gohan notices Frieza struggling against Dispo and comes to his aid, and he and Frieza fight, fight side by side. For now, let's work as a team, assuming you can keep up. Don't worry about me. Come on, Dispo. You're facing both of us now. Don't get cocky just because you landed one blow. If you want to double your universe's losses, that works for me. I'll send you both over the edge together. You can't win. For maximum light speed mode. I'll give you a fight. Now let's work as a team, assuming you can keep up. Don't worry about me. Come on, Dispo. You're facing both of us now. Don't get cocky just because you landed one blow. If you want to double your universe's losses, that works for me. I'll send you both over the edge together. I'll start. You can't win. You're moving a lot quicker than I expected.
Tom falls to his knees from exhaustion after a fight with Dispo. Meanwhile, Frieza joins after 17 and taking on Topo. The battle intensely rapidly ex escalates. At that moment, a change occurs in Topo and he suffers a relentless all song of attacks. Between Frieza and 17, he abandons his ideals of Justin and become a true god of destruction. His attacks drive Frieza and 17 back. The outlook of this battle turns grim. Gohan has been concentrating on recovering, but now goes to the aid of the others confronting Topo. Topo now a god of destruction. Justice and evil. I have moved beyond that binary now. There is only being and the absence of being. I will face you. Fight me, here and now. You need more than your fancy destruction energy to stop me. You think your trivial cause can compete with a destroyer's resolve? I ordain what will and will not exist. That's my cause. And to serve it, I will forsake all else. You dare call my cause trivial? I fight for Bulma, for Trunks and Bulla. I fight for the oath I made to a fellow warrior, for my say in pride. I fight for all I've built and all I am. Unlike you, I won't abandon all that to play God! Same here, Vegeta. I won't give up if you don't. I don't remember Gohan even fighting you, Chapo. Then let's do this! You got it. This is gonna be some type of what-if scenario. Scenario by accident. No matter the price. Okay. Have at you. Have at you. There you are. This is the end. You can't win. Now you see my true power. I'll give you a fight.
<sighs> Topo! Topo from Universe 11 has been eliminated. And with that, our time is up. Then... that means... As the team with the most warriors still in the arena, Universe 7 is victorious! Whoa. Bro, did, did I accidentally we do a what if? Run, guys! What are you so surprised about? You're the one who promised we'd win. I think I accidentally did a what if. <laughs> I did, didn't I? Now come on. Stand up and accept your victory before we go home without you. Yeah. Thanks, Vegeta. Let's get back. Everybody's waiting for us. Universe 7 reigns victorious. And for their wish, they ask Super Shenron to revive the other universes that had been erased. With his selfless request granted, the half Saiyan hero and his team return home, where he is welcomed by his loving family. Uh, I think I did a what if scenario by a complete accident. Unless that was just Gohan's regular. Let's see. Because technically he was supposed to be eliminated with Dispo. He wasn't supposed to be around when Topo even went into God of Destruction mode. Something happened right there. I don't know. I don't know. It looks like there's something else there, but I don't, I don't see it. So I'm assuming that's the end of Go Gohan's. So we're gonna head back. Continue on with Piccolo's. <laughs>